Kevin Long from JustMeans.com. I'm here with Erwin Miller from Ginsler. How are you doing, Erwin? Hey, Kevin. Doing great. So, Erwin, uh, tell me a little bit about Ginsler. Uh, we are a global architecture firm. We have uh, about 30 offices around the world, about 2,500 employees, um, working in all aspects of architecture, commercial, um, we have schools, retail, residential. Do you guys have uh, LEED certifica- certified architects? Certified. Certified. We, got, we have LEED certified um, architects. We have, I think we have one of the largest uh, amounts of LEED certified uh, professionals in the industry. Um, we have each employee does the uh, LEED AP program and uh, goes through the process. And we've also built a, a large number of LEED, um, LEED certified projects, LEED Silver, and so we're working on some LEED Platinum projects as well. So, are you you're speaking here at Opportunity Green, aren't you? Yeah, I am speaking. I'm speaking tomorrow. And what's your topic on? Uh, my topic's about collaboration. Col- collaboration. You mean competition? Well, collaboration, I mean, where we're coming from on this is uh, when Karen came to me from Opportunity Green and said, do you want to speak? I said, I'm not um, the expert you want to have speaking about green issues, although I care about them and I live them every day. But I, I sort of, uh, my interest is the way we work together and the way we collaborate and the way we um, get projects moving from start to finish. And I think that's key. So, so I hear this collaboration all the time, especially in the green community, but then the reality is when you're running a business, you just end up competing. Can you give an example of what do you mean by collaboration? You're talking with in-companies, uh, you're talking with competitors. Um, can you give an example? Well, I was at the, um, the Confluence of Influence yesterday where they got 40 of the leaders from the conference together and we were talking about some of these issues. And I mean, the green movement and sustainability is still, is still very young. You know, We don't think it is, but it's still getting off the ground and that's why we have conferences like this. And um, to achieve great results, we're going to need to work together. And frankly, you can work with your competitors and you can work with the skills that they need and the skills that you have. And it's putting those together to make a greater whole. And the goal at the end of the day is you're not going to need conferences and gatherings like this necessarily because we're all going to be doing it. It's going to be second nature. So give me an example of collaboration. Collaboration. Well, we just um, we finished a huge project in Las Vegas. We're the master architects on City Center, and the um, I remember the sales office we designed years ago was a lead project, and uh, the project itself is one of the largest lead certified private projects in the world. And you had uh, six or seven of the top architects of the world work on different buildings of that. You had different landscape designers, artists, planners. Um, lead specialists, environmental specialists, they all worked together. They all knew for the greater good they needed to make this project work. And that's the kind of collaboration that matters. And they all had a vested interest. And people loved their own building and they loved each piece they did. But they knew for the greater part of the project they needed to work together. Great. Well, I'm looking forward to your presentation. Thanks. Good talking to you. All right. This is Kevin Long from JustMeans.com at Opportunity Green.